Welcome everyone to another training session. This is Kenneth Macker, Associate Director of Sales and Director of the Training Department. So what we're going to be going over is our Diamond Series and this is going to be our brand new entry level full color at night camera. This is a dual illuminator camera. I'll talk a little bit more about what separates that in a second. Let's first talk about what it has in common with our traditional full color at night camera. Number one, it does have four megapixel. Number two, it is 30 frames a second. Number three, it has true WDR. Number four, it's a 2.8 millimeter. And number five, it is a full color LED light, so it's gonna get you the full color at night. So what is the differences between this camera and our previous unit? This camera, you can actually combine the SMD with the dual illuminator, and basically this will turn off the LED light. Okay, so for example, let's say it's 10, 11 o'clock at night, and uh, you don't necessarily want to have the LED light on, but then someone approaches your car, someone approaches your residential home, someone approaches your commercial building, the LED light will kick on and you can actually set it for the duration of how long you need that LED light on for. So this is a great option. Specifically, what this really opens up the door for, it's gonna be for residential customers. In the past, uh, residential customers have been a little bit skeptical about using full color at night cameras for the fact that the LED light is always on. Not everyone necessarily wants to have four cameras with LED lights on uh, in their residential home. So with this camera, when you combine it with the SMD+, it's only gonna have IRs at first, and then if someone approaches your home, or someone approaches your commercial building, it's gonna kick in, the LED light turns on, and it's gonna get you that rich, full, 24-7 uh, color at night image that we're looking for. So that's the biggest separation between this camera and the one in the past. And if you wanna pick one of these up, make sure you contact your ENS rep.